What's going on guys? It is Last NASCAR fan here and here I am with everything I got today for my birthday diecast wise. I pretty much spent over a hundred dollars. Uh, most of this, some of this was given to me for my birthday. So let's go over what we got. So we can start off here. With these two and also these two. I picked these up the day before. They were in my they were on sale at my grocery store. This was a quarter brand new and this was a dollar. So not a bad one idea. Not a bad one to grab. Here we got a really cool team Hot Wheels Sega All Stars car. I think this is the go kart that Danica Patrick drove in the game per se so that's pretty cool to have now in my collection that here we got a 24 7 it's really dusty i think the axles might be a little squealing maybe a bit squeaking but that's okay um we also i got this at the same place a firebird formula pretty cool pretty cool um, let's go to the next one. Okay, so here we got, I'm going to move some stuff out of the way. So all of this right here came from the next place. I found this awesome 124 Mark Martin Max Life Ford. My cat. Um, got that for $20. And then we also found a NASCAR Cafe promo. Originally from... The Orlando NASCAR Cafe, which is pretty cool. And here we got a Bristol uh, Fall Race promo from 2003. Along with that, we got a John Andretti Betty Crocker uh, promo, brand new in the package. Pretty nice to have. I don't have that one, so it'll be nice to add to my John Andretti promo cars as I'm missing a bunch more. I also found this a 2008 Jason Leffler 124 great lip great clips Toyota great car I can't believe I found that it's just amazing that I found that car I even know they even made this in the Motorsports Authentics might have been a promo I also found this this is a Jeff Gordon truck pretty cool so yeah, we got that. Um, let's go to the next thing. Um, I ended up getting that from my mom. She bought me this, a 2002 Coca-Cola NASCAR carrier, pretty cool. And then we also got this, a Woody Woodpecker 164 driven by Wally Dallenbach. Pretty cool, that's a really awesome die cast. Um, I went to my Goodwill and I ended up splurging some money on these 143s. We have Brian Refner's number three, John Mansfield Menard's uh, Chevy truck. He drove this in the 2000 season and uh, didn't do that well. So that's kind of like how he got, like he was like the first of the Menard sponsorships to come and go. And here we got a cool sterling marlin 143 i believe from looks like to be about 1993 because it's the, the old davis racing so yeah that's pretty cool uh the last store i went to oh yeah this also came from the same place i got the mark martin and the nascar cafe car but this on the other hand is a really cool aqua fresh indie car promo i found at my other antique store in my hometown really cool don't know who drove it i'm gonna have to do some research but this is a beautiful indie car it's ppg paint so i think this might be a penske but i'm not sure um the die cast i got for my birthday on the other hand are pretty cool we got Greg Biffle's 2007 Jackson Hewitt Ford. Beautiful die cast. Beautiful die cast. Along with that, we have the 2006 Greg Biffle Jackson Hewitt Ford. Another beautiful die cast. I'm glad to have that to my collection. We have Kyle Larson's 
clover throwback. Pretty cool. Along with that, a duplet. Um, Ricky Stones Jr., 2019, Fifth Third Bank. I'll just hang that on my wall. And then we got these two. We got both of these. We got a 2018 Kyle Larson, tr Treat Win, 164. And then we got Kyle Bush's 2019 M&M's Halloween Toyota. And that pretty much wraps up everything. So um, comment, like, subscribe for more videos. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care, guys.